for deadlock Chris here and after a little bit of skirmishing where we lost another manticore it was just one of those little skirmish missions where they send a fleet to harass a colonial world and I had to kick them off um, we're all ready to do this side mission this big fight so enough with the talking let's do this Here we go. I thought we were expecting that to take a bit longer, but it didn't. I was all ready to have to put in a like cut or something like that, but nope, not necessary. Okay. All right, bring you in about there. Can't sit. Ooh, green rings. Is that possible? I don't know. Um. Yeah, I think we're all set in that position. Let's go. Here Prepare we go. to jump Ooh, in three. That like a big fleet. Two. One. That looked like a big fleet. Dreadus contacts. All marks are hostile. It looks like there's only three there, but I swear I saw like five. Yep, there we go. Alright, uh, launch the Vipers. Launch them all. Okay, what I'm hoping it's like two Talons and three Nemesis, or three Talons and two Nemesis. I think three Talons, two Nemesis might be preferable. So say we all. Split up the fleet. Understood. Yeah, we'll split up the fleet. Uh, fighter. Oh, then tell me it's four nemesis. Um, uh, actually, we'll leave you guarding the Daedalus. We'll send you guys out. Squadron target is confirmed. Oop, too far. No, actually, one is. We'll send one squadron now. Have one squadron protecting the Daedalus for now. Let's slow everyone right down. Ooh, you, you guys have separated. I don't want you separating. I want you together. Stay together. Understood. No separating for you guys. Yeah, they're still coming up. Okay. Yes, sir. Come on. IFF Tell confirms it. unit is hostile. Nemesis, Nemesis. That's Nemesis, just with a singular gun shot. Tell us Nemesis, yep. Alright, let's slow everyone right down. Choose a target. Missile tubes prepped. And we will focus fire on your pal. Let's see damage as many targets as possible. Focus fire up there. You will spin you round. Missiles to you. Focus fire on you. Let's boost the attack power. It's a shame the Daedalus doesn't have missiles. That'd be awesome. Do it. Well, at least they're firing at us. Oh my, there's four of them. Uh, right, yay. Yeah. Take them on your side. 
Missiles incoming! Adamant is taking damage. Well, I'm not surprised. It's just got blasted with like three loads of missiles in one turn. Who's got that? Right, you've got damage on your right side. You're clean. All right. Well, we'll turn you away from this then. We'll spin you in midair as well. Yes, Commander. Adamant is taking damage. One down. Yes, sir. Focus fire on that one. You focus fire on that one. Yeah, let's take it down. Let's take it down now. Awesome. All right. Attack him. Attack him. Attack him. And can you guess? Yes, attack him. All right. You swing in. We want you to start getting yes, some commander. damage with those guns of yours. Uh, do some repairing on you. Armory. On it, Commander. Be focused. He's already dead, so. Unless there's two there. There might be two there, actually. Focus your fire. Yeah, we'll, we'll have the. Big ships attack whatever that automatic target is for now. Um, are you actually scratched in any way, shape, or form? I don't think you are, are you? No. In which case, you will get a nice barrage of missiles. Understood. From everybody, because well, that's how we like to roll. Oh, there is a ship there. I didn't think there was. Come on, kill it. How are you on it, Commander. You're losing everything, aren't you? Another one down. He's losing his armor on all sides. Yes, sir. Your front armor's shot. So say we all. Focus your fire on that. Let's kill that nemesis. Yeah, Adamant gone. is taking damage. Well, he's getting fired at the front. There's not a lot I can do about that. Target. Target. You swinging behind. You're on the same level as the Manticore. That's not good. Too far on that. All right. Adamant is taking damage. Should be able to survive it. This Talon is not going to have a good day now, though. Because it's getting a full on missile barrage. Hangar's kind of battered, armory's not looking good, engineering is completely gone. 
It's not gonna survive. Self-system repairs are complete. Yeah, the missiles hardly even got there. <laughs> All contacts down. Mission complete. Oh, that was a tough one. Fifty-eight, fifty-five, eighty. The the manticores are just laying waste at the moment. All right, so we got that little side thing. That's now got one thousand four hundred twenty-five requisition points. I mean, we've now started getting officers. Ah! So I'm going to recruit you. And you. And you. I'm going to assign you to there. You, we're going to assign to Colonial Fleet 12. It costs 50 points a piece. Uh, we've got one other fleet, so. June Max. I'm just assigning offices in general. Later I will be looking at these and seeing uh, what we can get. This gives you bigger fleets. Uh, this gives you particular things like combat engineer, engineering subsystem strength. So how long it takes for them to be taken offline and things like that. How fast subsystems repair, things like that. Tech bay, Dreadus range, could be useful. Um, we need another CIC. That could actually be really, really vital. Um, if you get boarded and they get to CIC and they take it offline, the ship gets destroyed. So yeah, we'll pick that one up. There you go. Done. All right. Now, um, officers, you are unassigned. We need to assign you to a fleet. So we will give you... Colonial Fleet 25, which only has... Actually, we won't give you that yet. We won't give you a fleet yet, because we need to make sure it's up to strength. Um, build ship. I need a manticore. Two turns. Needs to get to there. That's the one that we lost the manticore on. But, we need you to jump. Jump for my love. Let's go. All right, Fleet Group Daedalus, Helios Gamma, Chapter 5, the Mark II. Let's go it. <laughs> hey, a drink. I'm going to drink with me. I should have brought a drink with me. Okay, looks like we've got five ships. That can't be it. Mission prerequisites requires presence of Daedalus. Well, we've got Daedalus, there he is. Um, okay, well, yeah. Okay. Fleet group is jumping in three, two, one. Multiple Dreadus contacts, Commander. Scorpion Intel has already confirmed hostile bogeys. I knew they were under pressure out here, but this is the worst I've seen the Scorpion shipyards. Incredible they can get anything done under these conditions. Well, they are, so just accept it. Right, they are pretty much on the same plane as us, so we won't bother with uh, putting the adamant support down. We will with the Manticore, though, because his gun is underneath. Yes, sir. Slow everybody right Understood. down, though. Launch the Vipers. Should we crank up the guns now? Yes, let's crank up the guns now. At least on the adamants. The Manticore will go the other way. Enter. Alright. One, two. Alright, let's go and 
introduce ourselves. Select targets. Yes, go sir. For it. Select targets. Go for it. I'm even going to send in the Daedalus fighters. You can go after that target. Yeah, we'll go send two after the one of the Raider squadrons. Get there faster. Spin the adamant round. Get their guns in line. Come on, tell us what we see. Tell us what we see. Talon. Not wasting missiles on Talon yet. Not yet. Understood. If they end up hitting IFF it, confirms fine, unit I am is not hostile. firing my missiles at talent, not at this range. Oh, wow. We have a revenant. Uh-oh. Commander, uh -oh. I'm seeing hostile contacts not engaged in the fighting. They appear to be scouting the Scorpio fleet's wreckages. They'll be scavenging for ammunition. Destroy the wreckages before the Cylons can turn our own slugs against us, Commander. But Commander, I've got a word? I don't eh? often have the luxury of investigating field damage. A few moments of footage before you destroy those hulls could provide invaluable data. Um, we got a problem. We are way outnumbered. I mean, it looks mean. Don't think it has missiles or anything, though. No missile signatures or anything. Um, missiles. Fighters. Nothing. So it's a gunship. Not ideal. Um, I'm so, I, I really want to put the missiles into the Nemesis, but I'm thinking that might be better off going into that. No, Nemesis. Let's kill the Nemesis off. We do not have enough. We might end up losing this one, guys. Right. Uh, crank up. Focus fire. Forget that. Kill that. No. Cancel that target. Focus fire on the Revenant. Yeah. Missiles go for the Nemesis. Understood. Focus fire. Revenant's going to take all our, all our guns. It's going to take everything we've got. Go. Two lots of missiles coming in. Whoa. Just got missiles them. incoming. Manticore is probably going to die this fight. We're going in the right direction. Understood. Left and rear of the Manticore is dead. Uh, let's cancel your target. Focus fire on you. How are our fighters doing? All right, you're chasing that. No, we're going to send you over here. What about you? You're engaged there. You're engaging the Revenant. Yep, 
you're chasing those. No, no, you're not chasing those anymore. Select. No, not select target. Move. Alright, so we've got two squadrons that are going back this way. You are doing stuff. Manticore is taking damage. Don't really have a choice on the old Manticore taking the damage there. It's going to take a, a pound in, basically. It's going to die. On it, Commander. Please kill that Revenant. Manticore is taking damage. Yep, front armor's gone. Alright, what about our fighters? You're attaching that, no. So we want you attacking... None of them. That. Squadron target is confirmed. You're on your way there. You're on your way there. You're on your way back. We will move you into here. Manticore is taking damage. Manticore's been taking damage for ages. Could you please stop? Friendly unit that? is down. I knew that was going to happen anyway. So why bother? Oh, thank you. Um, select target. Yes. Select target. I don't want to do that. I want you to go after this. Why wouldn't you go after this? No, not that. This. Cancel. Thank you. Damn it, it's just so annoying. Uh, move. There. Targeting unidentified. You're attacking the nemesis. You're moving to that. Okay. And so. Why is the Revenant still alive? Should be dead by now. Alright. I think it's about time we started using mass missile fire again. I don't think we're going to keep our adamants either. I think they're all going to die. Adamant is taking damage. Adamant is taking damage. Thank you. Lost rear armor on. Oh no, lost rear armor on one. I haven't lost it on both. Yes, Commander. That's now targeting that talent, which is great. Focus fire, forget you. You're annoying. So 
We'll move you like that so you can get a good shot on that. Actually, we'll switch this around. You will go that way, you will go that way. Personally, don't want you shooting through your own friends. Cool. And you will focus fire without your fire control. That's helpful. Adamant is taking damage. Really don't think we're going to survive this one. Commander. I gave you an order. Sir, the commander was following up on a request from Sinan for damage reports before. Mr. Quaid is not in command of this fleet, Lieutenant. Destroy those wreckages now. Okay. I'm kind of busy getting my butt kicked over here. Do you mind? That's that one done. Uh, you. Select target. You're selecting that target. Right, they're all destroyed. Okay. Still don't have fire control back. What about you? You're still being really annoying. Please kill it. Adamant is taking damage. Done. Right. What the frack? Commander, all hostiles are disengaging. Admiral Kane isn't happy with us. But at least we stopped the Cylons from salvaging any more ammo from those Scorpion ships. Lucinda is becoming rash in her decisions. That was valuable data we could have used. She forgets she must prove the stability of Colonial Fleet to the Quorum. Well, if the Cylons keep running away, maybe you can finally finish building those Jupiters. And build us one while you're at it. We could do with the firepower. Right, Commander? A little bit. Okay, completely confused there. Seriously confused. Wow, that was... not going our way, and then suddenly... Mission accomplished? It says successful at the top. Whew, that was tough. That was really tough. Maybe I should have spent more time doing uh, build side battles and with officers in the fleets. But I wanted to show you guys that when we got our first officers, you know, so. We were seriously outnumbered. At least we get by from Mark IIs now. I'm just a little happy about that. I mean, we did give ourselves like a good showing, didn't we? It's not like we, uh... Ha 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 ha. They brought in talents to do that thing. a target rich environment I suppose. Not sure what 
sure what I was happening with that shot, but okay. Ouch. That pilot's drunk. That was the Revenant dying. One lone fighter running away from a load of vipers, and he didn't make it. Okay, that's good. I think, yeah, that's where it ended. Wow. Fifty-nine percent. Fifty-seven percent. Ah. Ranger, Artemis, and Viper Mark II. Eight hundred requisition points. Bought. Yeah. Okay, Viper Mark II squadrons can now be equipped by any unit with a squadron slot during FTL insertion. Mark II variant of the Viper sheds the older model's reliance on armor plating and instead relies on the reflexes and intuition of the pilot. Faster proportionate updated RCS provides the Mark II unparalleled superiority in space and atmospheric combat. Awesome! Right, we can pick up torpedoes as well, I suppose. Uh, the Artemis is 2,200 requisition points, so it's going to require us to get some bits and pieces together. We need to uh, basically double the requisition points we have already. I've already got the Adamant. Ranger, we'd need another, what, 325? That's a good ship. It's double the uh, missiles, but it's not a uh, close-in support, and you have to make sure the firing lanes are clear. And you still need to be able to see the target before you can shoot it. But it's an awful lot of missiles. I mean, that's ten missiles. If you choose one target, it fires them in five missile bursts. So you can either fire at two separate targets, get five missiles on each, or you can uh, fire at the, like both missile tubes at the same target, and that's ten missiles on one impact. So, mm -hmm. you know what, I'm going to pick up the torpedoes. Or am I? I'm going to think about that. We do have fighters though. The Viper Mark II's, which means everyone gets Viper Mark II's. Everybody gets Viper Mark II's. Okay, we need... We need two Manticores. Now you might notice that the uh, build time, uh, the build cost has gone down. That's because of this planet, Scorpio. If you've got the Daedalus around them, then you get these bonuses in the bottom corner. So 15% off the promotion costs and 10% off build costs for the ships. And we get, because it's fortified, we have a, an officer there, that goes up to 22 Tillium. And Pycon is faltering at the moment, but we're getting 34 Tillium per turn off them because we have an officer in orbit. Libran. We need to get a fleet over there. We're getting nothing out of them. And we've got a fleet here, which is, I think, over Geminon. And that's not going to actually do anything because it's unfortified. Because we don't have an officer with them. Um, so, you know what? We're going to do that now. We're going to put an officer above them now. Sign, playing fleet 25. We'll just hope they don't get into a fight. Now if we check German on. Not there yet. Can't be there yet. That's alright. Um, we're also going to start building fleets. Lovely fleets of ships. Base fleets are best set up as Manticore and two elements. Simply because it maxes out your fleet score for uh, a 
baseline officer. And we've got 1700 uh, Tylium, so we may as well use it. And then you just spread them out. You stick an officer with them and you put them over the colony worlds. And as they get into more combat, they get ex more experience, and then you can upgrade them and get bigger fleets and blah, 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 blah. But you'll basically see that when I start going, look, we have an Artemis in this fleet. Look, we have a Ranger in this fleet. But anyway, I think that's the two fights over and done with, so let's... Corvette is ready for orders. Yeah, it is. Now, this, uh, we're gonna get it over here as soon as possible, so hopefully it will make it without being ambushed. Cylon escort group has been detected. Sweet. No, it didn't make it. All right, emergency jump. It's got no chance against that. 40% chance. I'm not wasting it. Oh, but it's... It costs more to emergency jump it out than it does to build a new one. Let's all to resolve and hope. Nope. It was destroyed. All right, let's put you with Daedalus. Uh, what have we got building? We've got one building there, and those two. So they all will be ready in the next turn. Done. All right, so we're going to build that fleet. We're going to leave it here with an officer. And then we're going to move Daedalus to here, because that means wherever we want to send ships to, there's one jump, and they're there. Uh, the next story mission is up there, so yeah, looking pretty good. I'll be a little fleets covering these areas, and then we'll move. We'll build a nice big fleet to go and deal with this. But that will be next time. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, then please do hit that like button. Don't forget to comment and share the video. Um, if you're new to the channel, you like what you saw, then please do consider subscribing. Just hit the logo in the middle of the screen or hit the subscribe button down below. But until next time, you lot take care of yourselves and I'll see you there. Bye bye.